This is a really good topic. How do you think counterfeit money gets discovered? They don't discover all the other ways of possibilities of how the money would look. They memorize the one that is right. And this can be the this can be the case for religion. This can be the case for self-improvement. So you're not listening to like all these different people that have all different opinions. I think you need to find your opinion. You can't keep on following somebody like a little lackey. I don't know if you guys know what that means. That's like an old term. But you can't keep following somebody all around just because that's what they're telling you all the time. And I really found that that I really just want to follow like what this one guy says, but some of the things that he says aren't very accurate or they can't be accurate to your beliefs. Does that make sense? All these different fitness influencers telling you to do different things, to train for athletic athleticism that's what i'm trying to say athleticism some people are trying to tell you to train for bodybuilding some people are trying to tell you to train for calisthenics and it's going to be biased to what they do and maybe you're not an athlete so why would you train for to be an athlete and if you're not a bodybuilder why would you train to be a bodybuilder maybe you like being outside like today I'm, i literally train in the gym all the time but today if you can see the gym the little weights right there and the bench i was doing like bulgarians split squats i was doing like lunges and i just I had a lot more fun doing that today. And I'm not saying that I'm gonna only work outside because I don't, I usually go to the gym, so I'm not trying to mislead you or anything like that. But I think it's really important to not just follow the crowd. And because I know most people that I used to work out with be like, why would you work outside and not in the gym? But I just really wanted to hear the birds chirping, you know, the sun get a little tan, just like just like the old bodybuilders at, right at Muscle Beach, you know what I mean? I actually went there, that was a really cool experience. I mean, there was really nothing that special about it. I don't really recommend it, but it was kind of cool to see like all the videos that are filmed there. At this point, if you're just piggybacking off of what everybody else says, I give it your mission. This is your mission to find what you truly love doing and what you're going to be able to stick with. Not what somebody's telling you online or what somebody's telling you in real life. It's your life. You have to live it. I'm telling you this with passion. It's your life. You have to live it. You can't just let somebody else live it for you. You can't just let what other people think. Oh, but I think that's going to be weird when I'm an engineer because my, all my family are plumbers. I'm just giving random examples, but does that make sense? Like you can't just let your family dictate what you do, your friends. And I know most time they just want what's best for you, but I think you know what's best for you. Hopefully they support you. I support you in any goal that you have. Comment it down below. And that's what I'm going to leave you on today. And get outside, guys.